Girls deserve the opportunity to lead. Girls deserve a quality education. Girls deserve to have role models. Girls deserve to have confidence in themselves. Girls deserve to be healthy. Girls deserve to be safe. I've lived here all my life in Oakland. Growing up, my parents wouldn't let us out of the house because it was too dangerous sometimes. We got into this situation where we became homeless for a while, and that made me want to succeed and become better. In middle school, I wasn't that confident. I had a lot of uh, self-esteem issues. All the physical bullying, the verbal bullying, affected me negatively and made me see myself as nerdy, geeky, ugly names that people called me. That was never the case. That has never happened at all at Girls Inc., but quite the opposite. Every experience was like a learning experience. They always encouraged us to take risks. Always. The opportunities I have had opened up my world. Trying new activities like zip lining, sailing and surfing got me out of the house, made me more confident and helped me learn to take positive risks. <laughs> It started off with the mentors understanding each and every girl as her beautiful individual self and creating just a culture of sisterhood. I am brave, she's saying. I am fearless. A lot of my peers got over their shyness, felt more bold, felt more comfortable, and not only realized our interests, but pursued them in full force. Girls Inc. has really set a foundation for that. They've helped me with career classes and college classes and just guidance in that way. I'm so into mathematics and science and instead of dismissing me as weird and different, they wanted to know more about it. I'm opening out of my shell because I've been so hurt from all the bullying. This is what the world is like, but this is what we can do about it. Through engineering, I realized I could apply my love of that into innovations that can help the way people live their lives. One of the projects was making a solar-powered bus model. I get this call saying I would be going to the White House Science Fair. I had the honor of shaking President Obama's hand. That was the first time I saw myself as someone who could be a scientist. All these opportunities help girls keep taking positive risks and keep learning. I'm the first to go to college. Are you proud of her? Yes. <laughs> I used to think that I was not good enough. Girls Inc. has reassured me that I am good enough that I can go to college and I have the power to help others. I'm actually here, I actually graduated. I have Girls Inc. to thank for taking care of me 110% of the way.